Stanford. In just days, 45,000 people signed up to get a vaccine from UTRGV. So for now, they're not accepting any new registrations. CBS4's Mike Jimenez tells us what UTRGV is doing to get more doses. Last week, UTRGV was flooded with people wanting to get vaccinated. We are constrained by the supplies that we get. And at this point, we're only receiving about 3,000 doses a week. We would hope to receive more. So it's going to take a long time for us to work through the 45,000 people already on the list. UTRGV is prioritizing those 65 years and older because officials say they have the greatest risk of serious illness or death. UTRGV officials say with their current staffing, they could vaccinate five to 6,000 a week. Now, if we could increase our staffing, if we had funding for the infrastructure, because basically the more people we have, the more cost there is to us. Dr. Krause says they are working with the state and various other agencies to get a more reliable supply. And because the supply is uncertain, they are temporarily suspending new registrations. Because we don't want the list to get so unwieldy that it, that it confuses people or it gives people false expectations. Officials say registration will be suspended until they can get a handle on what the supply will be on a more reliable basis and work through some of the list. Working for you in Edinburgh, I'm Mike Jimenez. Once more vaccines are received, UTRGV will call those on the list to set up an appointment.